Hello and welcome to Power Drift. Now people are not buying cars anymore. Manufacturers are on the back foot, jobs are being lost, dealerships are bleeding. But then there's a steely manufacturer from Korea which is Hyundai which is giving us more and more cars. But this time around they decide to give us more than more because they decide to give us a grand i10 NEOS when NEOS means more. So let's get talking more of the grand i10 NEOS. Now, Hyundai says that the Grand i10 NEOS makes you feel alive. But then the problem is that we can't catch more of the car there because of all the people surrounding the car. But we have more than just that way to catch the car which would be going through this brochure so that I tell you all that the Hyundai Grand i10 NEOS is. That would make you feel like you were in a Hyundai showroom, which you are, but this showroom is called Power Drift where we talk interesting cars and motorcycles. So tap that notification bell, subscribe to the channel and let's get started so checking the car out like you were in the showroom and flipping across the pages you find something very interesting which is boomerang shaped LED DRL now this is very interesting because this is something that I haven't seen in cars of this segment the other part is R15 diamond cut alloy wheels and I think this has been seen on the venue and I quite love them on the venue. I love them out here on this car too. And then there is a unique brand i10 branding on C pillar. How unique is that? I'll leave that to you. Uh, projector headlamp, shark fin antenna. Flipping over the page, you know that there's, it's equipped with Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, voice recognition and a 13.64 centimeter digital speedometer. Dual tone color interior option. Flipping over the brochure further, you know that you get rear AC vents, wide and spacious cabin for four people, yes, wireless phone charger and then uh, rear parking camera. What I really like is that there is a driver rear view monitor. So while you're driving further forward, you can keep checking your rear view mirror. And if you're not used to that, then you can check this screen. I advise you to check your rear view mirror and not the screen to talk about the zestful performance as the brochure says of the petrol engine and the diesel engine. The petrol is a BS6 engine, the diesel is not a BS6 engine. But to speak of engines, let's at least try and get closer to the car or right inside the car. See you soon. Priced between 5 lakhs to 8 lakh rupees, the Grand i10 NEOS comes with automatic manual transmission that is AMT, comes in 6 color options, gets a nice looking steering that is tilt adjustable keyless entry, push-button start and well-built white interiors that makes Vigo and Swift look outdated. The Grand i10 NEOS is seen here in India first before its launch in Frankfurt in a month telling us that this is an important market for the steely manufacturer from Korea, Hyundai. I'll be driving the car in a week's time from today and that's when you can catch up with the Grand i10 NEOS and all that it is to drive, feel, comfort, ride, what not on our channel very soon. Stay subscribed. Uh, let's summarize then our first contact or first impressions with the Grand i10 NEOS. First off, it's a car that's based on Grand i10 platform, but it's bigger, it's lighter and it's safer, you could say, offering more space. Now, because it is light, the fuel efficiency numbers have also gone up. What happens to the Grand i10 is the biggest question, was the biggest question. What happens is that it stays. However, the Grand i10 will only now be available in petrol variant, uh, that too just in two trims and there will be no automatic for the Grand i10. That's it from me here in Delhi with our first impressions of the Grand i10 more or the Grand i10 NEOS as we come back with more Grand i10 NEOS to you from our first drive report. Stay tuned to Power Drift, ladies and gentlemen. I'm hungry. So goodbye.